Today, we are talking about the controversy of buying your meta verification or your blue check mark. Let's get into it's it. It's Melissa, your stylish social media strategist. I've been seeing a lot of people talking about, oh, if you buy your blue check mark, your, your cap, it's clout, it's blah, blah, blah. Previously, you need to have verification of your brand, your name, or your business because there were so many people hacking Instagram accounts and that has not changed. So when Meta came out with the buy your verification feature, it was giving us a little bit of a pause. I'm not even going front. But why this is important is because if you've ever had your account hacked, if you've ever had issues with bots, if you've had ever had issues with just people leaving rude comments, you would never be able to get in touch with Facebook or Meta. This blue check that they have rolled out right now, even though it does cost $15 a month, allows you to get access to a Facebook or Meta employee when your account is has been hacked. Is it fair that people who were previously verified now have to pay for verification? No, that's absolutely not fair. And a lot of this has to do a lot with capitalism. But this is the option that we have right now. This new verification and having access to be able to talk to a Facebook or Meta employee is the is worth the $15. Also, if you are a business owner, a brand, or a creator, you can roll this price point into your business expenses. So if you feel like it's not serving you or doing you any justice, you can literally turn the subscription service off. For people who think, oh, it's just clout. You're just trying to seem more important than you need to be. I mean, that's how you feel about something versus the person who is acquiring it. I don't know everyone's intentions, but as a business owner, a brand developer, as an influencer, I see it as a tool that you can use on Instagram to keep your peace of mind. And I will pay $15 a month to keep my peace of mind even though it seemingly feels like a scam.